Oh, hi everyone. Welcome to Destination Carry um, with uh, yours truly, Michael. Thank you for joining me. I, you know, it's, I just hope one day that I can have a show and, you know, you know what? He's, you'll join, you'll allow me to join you every time. You know, he's or, my Vanna. Oh, isn't I'm he, your Vanna? Isn't he a sexy little bitch? Wow. Aggression right out of the gate. Yeah. How did, how did I get to be Vanna? Because I don't know. You're sexy. That's, I mean, that's, I completely understand. <laughs> I just wanted to know like how, how that happened. I appreciate it. <laughs> Well, who do we got here? Sherry G was like in chat like way early. <laughs> I'm so talk ready for cocktails. this. Cocktails, Sherry. No, that's Maureen. 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 You know what, Maureen? Carrie, don't read so good. No, I, I swear. I have, I don't know. I have issues, but <laughs> you guys already knew that. But you know what, Maureen? Do you want to know like how bad I read? I thought you were Frenchy for the longest time. And uh -huh. <laughs> Michael's like, stop calling them the Frenchies. <laughs> I mean, I go, are the Frenchies coming? And he's like, stop. <laughs> Roy R. Does Things need my client and carry fix. Hey, we need our Roy R. Does Things fix. We get it. Mm. Univ Poke. Univ Poke. Univ Woohoo. What, what does that mean? For Ben. Mike Franklin, how you doing, brother? Aiden Craig, Gary Franchi, and <gasps> Maureen Franchi, the, the Frenchies, the best Frenchies ever. <laughs> uh, Cheech Artelino, Julie Like, how you doing, Julie? How you doing, Cheech? Sorry to hear that you guys are having the rain issues. We're having beautiful weather issues. It's weird for Michigan, you know. Caitlin Brubaker, how are you doing? Dan Like, how you doing, brother? Dave Markowski, Roger D. Oh, and then my chat skipped. Love it. it. Did. Uh, Ben Elkhorn, how you doing, dude? Sugar Kitty, uh, Tim Evans, Trevor Deal, Mark Bond, how you doing, Mark? Man, I miss you. Common Sense, Jesse Page, Kelsey Klein, how you doing, girl? John T, you guys, we just love hanging out with you guys tonight. Mr. Whiskey Shits, how's it going? How's it Whiskey going? Whiskey Shit. Oh, it is Shit. Lochner, Cameron Lochner in the house. What's going on? Thanks for coming back, hanging out with us after my week long hiatus of. Having some food poisoning where Carrie tried to kill me. It's giving me expired food. <laughs> hey, I bought that stuff like three days prior. I bought Weeks, two months, pounds. days. Two pounds of broccoli salad. Who would have known that it would have went bad in three days? Two pounds of four-week-old broccoli <laughs> salad. I don't understand it. That doesn't, doesn't make any sense. happen. No idea. <laughs> pounds made up. Alec, how you doing, brother? Glad you're here. Good to see you. Ron Miles, what's up, dude? The Garage Mahal is coming slow, slow. I was gone in San Antonio all week in Houston, and uh, we got rid of all the cabinets, though. So the cabinets are all gone. Gonski. Gonski. So now we can start doing some Garage Mahal So now Mahal the real work. shit's going to get started, and I'm going to design the best studio. Oh, boy. Here it goes. The best studio. I do everything grandioso. Uh, over, the, uh, over the top, overboard. That's how I roll. That is how she rolls. We do need that garage. What's up, Bourbon Junkies? How you doing, Danny? What's going on, buddy? Oh, oh look at Tom Flanagan. I made it. What? Welcome. Welcome, Tom. I'm glad you made it. God, I was I was worried. <laughs> you got you got here just in time. Uh, Broccoli at, salad could be unexpired and still have the same effect. That is probably true. I just love Sugar Kitty. Who doesn't love Sugar Kitty? Sugar Kitty is by far one of our best. Like. He, she, is it a he? Is it a she? Is it a hermaphrodite? Is it a little bit of each? I don't know. We, Sugar Kitty, you have never disclosed your sex. Well, yeah, Sugar Kitty has said at one point, I believe in one of the streams, that there's a Mr. and a, and a Mrs. Sugar Kitty. So there's two, there's two kitties in the, in the bunch. So do they ever differentiate who's who? I don't, I don't think so. I, I mean, I could be wrong. I don't think so. Meow, meow. I mean, it could be. I thought I heard HBR say it was old force or single barrel uh, poisoning. No, Gary, <laughs> definitely wasn't. I mean, that could there, do it. There have been times that the bourbon has turned your gills green. There has been times. Sounds made up. But this time, the broccoli turned him green. That sounds made up. Totally made up. <laughs> ADHD whiskey's in the house. Well, What's up, hello, Maddie, Matt? Oh, Matthew. You sexy beast. Is, is that? there anybody out there that can rock a sweater vest better than Matt Porter? I don't think so. And I don't ever want to see anybody that can. Because so, in my mind, 
he is the sweater vest. So, Tom, funny, we were out to dinner tonight, and he was at the Mets game earlier. And I said, oh, my gosh, there's, like, fans in the stadium today, tonight, when we were watching. He was at the Rockies game. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, But yeah. I still said, and you're like, yeah, yeah. some teams are. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah. that happened. I said, I, she saw it, and I said, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I was just crazy. Yeah. He, he, well, no, you said some are doing, like, 25%. Some people are doing 50%. <laughs> he shook. <laughs> Sometimes Klein just walks upstairs and doesn't come back. Sometimes you never know. That is true. He, you Stranger have been things known. have happened. Stranger things have happened. But or he went inside or to the side of the house and never came back. Right now, Mister Poke, I am drinking some Henry McKenna bottled and bond ten year. Since I'm doing a flight with the likes tonight, or from the likes tonight, I am trying to kind of set my palate a little bit so I can try to guess what these. Uh, proofs are so hopefully they stick around for the entire time and let me know what i'm actually drinking because right now i don't have a clue we were all lucky enough to see him in a sweater vest in person we were it was life-changing it was an event it was just something that i'm like this this is how life should be hanging out with the sweater vest carrie what are you making tonight i in honor of the derby what am i gonna make i don't know what am i making a mint dweep it's the only person I know that can't say julep. It's julep. <laughs> it's French. It's it's literally julep. Everyone on the planet knows it's julep. I've never heard anyone say julep. In fact, when you left today, I laughed for five minutes after you walked out the door because you closed the door. And as you're closing the door, you said julep. <laughs> I'm going to go get some mint for julep. <laughs> I honestly don't even know what that is. Julie. But apparently Carrie's going to do a bourbon julie tonight. Mint. A julie. bourbon mint julie tonight. Julie. Say it right. I can't. <laughs> I'm going to have you saying julie before you know, know I it. I can't. I can't possibly say julie. Can't happen. Uh. Sorry, leaving to go see Sugar Kitty live. What? Sugar Kitty's going live? No way. What? Get out! When it, when it, where, where, where is Sugar Kitty going live? Oh, uh, I don't. Know. I think I think poor Ben was just kind of joking, but maybe, maybe Sugar Kitty's leaving to go live. Are you? There's a ten plus minute live hangout on Instagram. Get out! Well, there you go. Huh? People are abandoning me for the Sugar Kitty. I get it. I would. In fact, I maybe I'll just shut this thing down. <laughs> go watch Sugar Kitty. It's been fun, guys. Take care. <laughs> What's up, Stan Wags? How you doing, man? Love you, too. Rye Guy, how you doing, brother? Yeah, we're going to do this. We're going to do this. I have, a, I have a recorded live stream on Insta. Sweet. Mr. Mister Hunt is so itchy. That's good to know. It's a great, great name. I love it. <laughs> I've got a really cool story about that name, but not for here. Maybe for another day. Hello, Caitlin. I forgot to say hello to you earlier. Sorry. Caitlin Brubaker, of course you're still here. Oh, and, and can you all stop saying Julie? I like saying Julie. <laughs> I think you're calling me <laughs> <laughs> Julie. Julie. No, it's Julie. So, Caitlin, when are we going to do our um, our cupcake slash bourbon taste off? Remember, we talked oh, about yeah, this yeah, a few yeah. weeks ago. That was some stuff, dude. And Mister Dude, what's up, DC? How you doing? Dave Markowski, I'm, you're always here for me. I know 100% you're always here for me. I'm Slade, good Slade, no. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> That's so wrong, but so right. It's just 10 minutes of sugar kitty licking itself. That sounds about right. <laughs> With his mm. catnip. This is a. This is kind of a... It's one that I forget about, this McKenna. I, I, I don't want to say it's... It's underrated because it's it's definitely not. People charge way too much money since it won an award. But it's one I forget about. And when I come back to it, I'm actually pretty fond of this McKenna bottle and bond. Yeah, that's, a, that's a quality, quality bourbon. So what are you gonna start making your julep? I'm gonna start pouring this stuff. So no. what I'm what I'm doing tonight is a flight that's called What's in a Name? So the only thing I know. Is that the the all the bottles in here have a a name like a, a a brand of a name like Pappy Van Winkle? That's a name. So 
Uh, I would imagine like Elmer T. Lee is a name. Um, you know, what else did William LaRue Weller is a name. So uh I don't know what they what they have sent me, but I know that I need to rank them in the order that I like them. And then I need to guess proof, which is perfect because I need to try to start getting back on this blind thing before I get shit stomped by I Whiskey She Wines on Matt's Matt's stream. So which I just want to say I can't wait. We're gonna be with Sammy and Bobby tomorrow night. Yay! I love my Sammy. We are. We're gonna be with Sam and Bobby for Bobby's birthday celebration tomorrow on I Whiskey She Wine. So if you can't get enough of us tonight, you can always come back tomorrow on I Whiskey She Wines and check us out tomorrow. Because me and Sam, we do shit right. <laughs> Dan L says, but no Pappy or WLW, I promise. Thanks. I think. I don't know. I, I don't know if I should be thanking you for that or not. <laughs> so I'm gonna get in, I'm gonna start getting into this. I got A in front of me. I'm going to start smelling these. Why don't you start making your stuff while I'm, I'm smelling? I'm not ready yet. Ooh. That smells nice. Will you hand me my thing over there? My metal thing? What's a metal thing? Over there in the arcade. Good God, it's woman. It's right every, next to you. Every stream. I say, <laughs> if, if you guys could see the pile of shit. Are you ready? This is what Carrie has in front of her. <laughs> like everything under the sun. I mean, anything you can think of. And I'm like, make sure you have everything. I do. We sit it's, down. She's like, oh, you know what? Can you go get me the microwave? Like, there's <laughs> no, something I I'm said, missing here. No, I said, will you get me my coconut drink? Will you get me a water? Yeah, thank you. Welcome to my life. Oh, it's not so bad, baby. After your stream with HBR, I may be nearing my client stream limit for the week. Caitlin. Caitlin. No. No. You can't. That's, this is a new week. HBR was last week. This is Sunday. Whole new week. Come on. Silly. That's just silly of you to say. What's your point, human? I wish I had one. Whiskey Nose. What's up, McFly? Are you going to tell me how shitty my shirt is tonight? I mean, I mean, am I... I don't know. I just want to know. Am I... Hey. Am I dressed well enough for you, Mar hey. uh, Marty? Cheech. Wait. Oh, no, 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 no. What was wrong with Drew Leap? He's actually the one who said it right. Uh, Julie. I think it was uh, the Jew part. Like, could no, have been. No, because uh, what uh, Maureen said, Jew lip, like Jew and lip. <laughs> I think he did it because he was on Team Carrie. Oh, that could saying, be. Saying Julie. Slightly offensive spelling. So he just wanted it. Like, that's what I thought. Oh. Yeah, yeah. See, that's what I said. Cause it's but, but Cheech, I'm a Jew. And I have Jew lips. <laughs> oh, <laughs> so I'm just right. saying, I am Jewish. <laughs> Marty, we listen, McFly. <laughs> we've already been through this. You don't, you don't need to keep apologizing. I just wanted to give you some shit because it's the fun thing to do. Wait, where? Where? Who? Who? Whiskey nose. The big green thing that says "I apologize." For what? He was telling me I w was wearing a shitty shirt the other night on HBR. What were you wearing? I was wearing my uh, purple uh, giraffe shirt. So you, you see, this one cares so little about this <laughs> channel. She literally is like, it's all about carry, 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 carry. So <coughs> if I'm not sitting next to her or dragging her downstairs and saying, you have to be a part of this, she she has no idea what I do. No clue. I can stream. She won't know. She has no idea. This smells really fruity. A does. Let me smell. Mm. Smells delicious. Like like strawberry starburst. I didn't get starburst out of it. Ooh. Damn, that's good. So far, so good. I like I like A. Whiskey knows you're gonna join us after this. Live wire whiskey. Uh live wire whiskey. You have a you having a stream after this? What's going on? Hmm. Wow, that's really good. A, not super proofy. Say somewhere around there. We'll see how this. We'll see how this pans out as I work my way back through. Mm. So far, so good. 
Oh, oh, that ace smells really good. After you are finished, awesome. Make sure uh, somebody dropped the link uh, for Live Wire Whiskey when I'm when I'm done, so they can check them out. Everybody Dad, can check them out. Dad, you are the best. Oh, Dan, you. I haven't seen you in a while. Dan mentioned Strawberry Starburst on one. I can't remember what it was. Remember, these are from the likes. Yes, Jamie. Bev Porter. Hey, Brat and Carrie. Hi, sweet, sweet, sweet Mama Porter. I'm going to watch my P's and Q's tonight just for you. Because I, I owe it to you after the my being an idiot on your son's stream. Bourbon Adventures, did you get my my Patreon message? Uh, did, did, no, I haven't yet. I will check it out. What's up, Austin? Ooh. You guys uh, see uh, Carrie and I singing, Why Do You Build Me Up, Buttercup? Could you be any more obnoxious? I'm making my julie. Oh, my gosh. This is how it is. <laughs> this is what you guys tune in for, right? This is what 105 people on a Sunday night are watching Carrie smash. Sugar. Sugar that's not even close to being <laughs> smashed. They're so big, Put four cubes. Put some liquid in it and then I, do it. That works a lot better. I want, I just liquid want, breaks down the sugar and it makes it easier. I know, but I just wanted just to break it up a little bit first. I'm just saying. Don't, don't. Don't just say. I'm just saying. Tom, she is the best. There's no doubt about that. <laughs> Thank you so much. B's got some uh, some spice to it. Oh, are you going to share with everyone our big news? Ooh, B's got a little nuttiness to it. Um, what news? Our news coming up. What news? Our big news. Are you going to recommend any more sites for young impressionable pharmacists tonight too? I could, Jason, maybe. Jason. Depends. What, what uh, I am going to share a little bit of news tonight. Uh, and that is, I'm kind of a piece of shit and I haven't sent anything, not one thing out from the charity stream yet. Because I left and I just got home Saturday night and I just haven't done it. And I am so sorry. I'm so sorry. So, so Chris so Smith, funny. Brian Casey, Alec Rubin, uh, Bob Bills, I have your bottle because. Um, Aaron Blizzard sent it to me, so I have that for you, and you are local. Sierra, Jason Busey, uh, Deborah Cohen, I know that um, Gary Franchi has already sent out your uh, your samples because I got your address. Thank you. Um, Chris Sprague, your local, and Danny, um, uh, ride time. I have I've not sent anything out yet. I am a slime ball, and I'm so sorry. I still need Ron Hawkins, if you're here. I need your... Address for uh, for um, Justin's House of Bourbon and Jessica Pushman. I need your address for um, the Detroit Whiskey Society samples. But everybody else, your stuff is going out tomorrow. I swear on Carrie's life. But that wasn't the news. Oh, that wasn't the news. No. <laughs> no. What's the news, Care? No, you tell everybody. You tell everybody. No, you. No, you. You. No, you. You. No. You. 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 I'm trying to do a, a I know, blind but whiskey But you know what? Here. This is the best thing for you. Hey, uh, um, uh, Alec, uh, you said you know the news. Why don't you tell everyone? Mr. Rubin, if that is your real name. Ooh, well, this one smells a little funky. Jer Bear, you know the news. Jer Bear, what's the news? Jeremy, why don't you? Tell everybody. For the reveal, Hollerhead, it's a girl. Blanton's, it's a boy. Carrie is not pregnant. It's impossible for me to get pregnant. She is not pregnant. Not possible. Promise like, you not pregnant. seriously, not even immaculate conception. Yep, Jeremy right. just did it. I'm out of the closet. <laughs> <laughs> if you can't count on your friends, who can you count on? <laughs> I'm scared it's the wrong news, and I'm not supposed to be sharing it. No, it's the right news. Uh, only you and Jeremy know the news. So Right? Oh, Miss Kelsey knows the news. She's here. So go ahead, Jeremy. Or No, I think you should say it. 
Uh, August 21st. 21. 21. So. Your lucky number. 21. 821. 21. 821. 821. You, the, the day that you came into this. I wasn't born on 821, but no. on the, I but was the born 21st on the 21st. Was his birthday. So. And it's your lucky number. It is my lucky number. Yep. The low low McBerry and I are gonna tie the knot. Low low marriage, low marriage coming. Low low marriage ceremony. Been engaged now for just sort of forever, so we decided it's probably probably best to actually but do you know something what? about it. We could stay the way we are, and everything would be great too. I you know, it, it's all about us being together, and that's all that matters. That is all that matters. Congratulations, you two! Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. We appreciate that, you guys. Um, and you, we feel like you guys are all of our family, so we wanted to make sure that you guys all knew what was going on, and uh, we're super excited. It's going to be a great time, and. Uh, I thought it was about the GG news. Sure, you did. Mm -hmm. Wait, 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 wait. Congrats. Who said that, GG? Chair Bear. Okay. Thank you. Oh my God, Jeremy. I am so proud of you. You even used the right. Thank you. We had this talk when he came to deliver mm. us meat. When, Ooh. when Jeremy delivered meat. Yeah, we get meat dropped off to us too. C tastes like Willet. That's not in a name. So it has a has a rye. I'm gonna say. Hmm. Hmm. See's got a, a weird ryeness to it. Where is the wedding? The wedding is going to be <laughs> Bender. Congrats, I think. No, definitely congrats. Yeah, the two of us have some good chemistry. Congrats, Michael. Carrie, I expect better. I Barn door expects more from his queen. I get it. Are you kidding me? This is a king right here. How could anything get better than this handsome fella? See, Dave Markowski said, I almost divorced my wife when I thought you were coming out of the closet. Close <laughs> off. I'm telling you. You are a sexy beast. I would have, you know, Dave, that, that I, I would hope that what? I'm the first call. I just wanted to say, like, the gay community loves you. Seriously. They eat him up. They, they, they love him. Literally. They really do. They love him. Don't do it, Klein. I know, Mike. I know. Look at Jamie Faye. Wait, it's Maz Mazel Tov. Mazel Tov. Mazel Tov. I did say, do we want a rabbi too? Because our friends are going to marry us. And I'm like, well, we should at least have a rabbi. Barn door. <laughs> Barn door. Barn I can take away your wrench. No, he wouldn't I'm, do I'll, that. I'll take away your wrench. Take will it away. You the skullet for the wedding? No, he yes, is not. Yes, I will. Fuck the beard. It's going oh away. Oh my gosh. You know what I should show you guys? This is, you guys will I, love this. You know what? And I know it's harsh, but no, he's getting rid of it. No, I'm not. You guys will love this because you guys are my, are my people. <laughs> so. Flanagan just said, I had a trial run with Klein. Not so great. Oh, uh, that's not true, Tom. It Wait. was pretty great. What was, wait, what's this trial run? Don't worry about it. <laughs> Were you guys spooning? My, uh, it was in Vegas, so, you know. What, what happens in Vegas stays in there? What, tuxedo t-shirts at the wedding? Yes. What do you guys think of that? <laughs> he came down and I said, no. No. Yeah. That's 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 only a taste of what's, <laughs> what's to come. That is what's coming. Bring that baby out. Oh, it's going to be so great. Oh, you need to do it on a live stream. Ever put up with Well, it own? would have to be a Patreon. So if you want to, then you will have to subscribe. And oh. I think we can make that happen. Oh. Oh, no. Is that broke? Is it? No, I think it's just a lot. Oh, yep. Nope, it's broke. One of my Golden Glens. Keep the mustache. That's epic. As I know. That's what I'm saying, Jason. That's that's what I'm. That's what's coming back. That was like two weeks ago. The wags mustache from billions. Exactly. Yep. I came down like that, and Carrie literally lost her mind. No, no, you're gonna go do something about that. No. Yeah. Oh, I was. Hava nagila hava nagila hava. 
oh, and do the little handkerchief, the white in the chair. Or just, mm. I want to be like Sonia when she was up in her chair. D. Remember when she was up in her chair waving her. Waving her what? Her little white handkerchief. Yeah, it is. That's exactly what I thought, uh, Slade. Snidely Whiplash. Mm. D. It's also a little nutty. Oh. Fantastic. You kids are made for each other, Slante. Oh, thank you. Uh, Slancha, I think is how that's pronounced. Slancha. Thank you, Patrick. I appreciate that, Maybe man. Maybe it's Slanty. No, it's not slanty. I, I know it's not. I know it's not. And I'm not making fun of the Irish You're making language. Fun of the Irish. <laughs> I think the Irish do enough on their own, don't they? Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, you know what I for oh I do have a little bit of water. I'm like, I almost forgot just a titch of water. So everyone pay attention. Mm. I'm adding uh, like a teaspoon of water. Oh, congratulations on jumping on the broom. Uh, you're welcome. Thank you so much, Maureen. Oui. These are uh, these are not so easy, uh, Dan and Julie. I think I'm getting around the proof points, um, but they're all they're all kind of different. So trying to figure out what is what, as far as uh, what I like the best, they all have different flavor profiles. Christopher Casca, that room is sick. Thank you, sir. Wait till you see the garage mahal. It's even more sick. Sick. What are, you, are you like typing people? Yes, everyone's blowing me up. Carrie. What? I'm paying attention. I'm trying to have a live stream here. <laughs> I don't know. You guys all know that. We're trying to have a live stream. Well, you know, Carrie's in case... like, <laughs> <laughs> live stream. Not for me. I'm just here. Jamie, you, know? you did not miss the explanation yet. I just haven't started. I started like muddling some, some sugar. That's... She's literally done zero things except <laughs> type on her phone. Hey, that was not cool. They say a, a man is not complete until he's married. Then he's so, finished. So it's like, we are either going to go to Greece or Italy or all of it. It's, so it'll just be postponed until some of this goes away. The COVID stuff. But yeah, we'll be going to Europe. Uh, there's going to be a pole in the garage. Mahal. Are you kidding me, DC? How else am I going to get you to come over? <laughs> With your G-string. Oh my god, yeah, my bachelor party. Um, this is gonna be a, a bunch of us middle-aged women that will probably be passed out by 9 30. Yeah, Carrie's bachelor party is gonna end by 10 o'clock at the latest. <laughs> because I can have like two drinks and I'm like done ski. Roy, thank you, brother. We appreciate that. Uh, uh we're we're excited. No, Carrie's uh been talking about going to Greece for a Italy or Italy for a long time now. So, and so I wanted to go when when I still thought I was Italian until I found out we were hidden Jews. Um, I <laughs> it's true. Um, I wanted to go to Sorrento, and then we could like take the ferry back over to mainland, take him over to Rome, and then do Sardinia and go to over to Mount Vesuvia. I mean, just spend like two, maybe three weeks over there. So yeah, lots of fun. We could go up, to, we could actually travel, travel in three weeks. Travel, travel. Travel, we travel. We could, we could actually travel, travel. We could even go to Sicily. Might go to Sicily. Right. Go to Naples. Is Barn Door invited to the bachelorette party? It depends, are you gonna be, can we put a uh, dollar? He has breakaway pants. Oh, absolutely. There you go. And just please wear like a leopard banana hammock so that we can put some ones in your string. Do I need to get my Aquaman suit dry clean for the bachelorette? Um, uh, yeah. Do you look like Momoa? He says they're basically twins. Where the fuck are you then? Jason Busey. Yeah? Yeah. Basically twins. <laughs> basically twins. Yeah. I mean, almost exactly the same. I, I. Don't Sorrento, no, you have is not on the mainland, Sugar Kitty. You Dan actually, Lake. You actually have to take a um a, a boat over. You fly into Rome, then you have to take a boat over to Sorrento. And then from Sorrento, you take another boat to go over to Vesuvius. 
Mm. Wow. So who's going to be barn door or Busey? Or both of them are going to be my little strippers. Yeah, they both are. They're in. Oh, this is going to be so much fun. Yeah. Yeah, uh, Gary, or uh, Gary, Jane, Gary Busey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. Jason Busey and uh, barn door <laughs> with the breakaway pants and the Momoa. It's going to be awesome. Likes, quick question. Highest JD Heritage 2020. Rye or had they have all y'all have seen. I think the highest one I saw was like 134, 134.4, 134.1, something like that. Hey guys, guess what? Carrie's back on her phone. We have yet to start making the cocktail of the night. Uh she's smashed some some sugar really <laughs> loudly into the microphone. Okay, 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 but, okay. You know, that's it. Okay. That's all we've got so going I, on right now. The so. recipe calls for for two sugar cubes. Um, I put four because you guys know how much I like my shit sweet. So, and then we're going to take eight mint leaves and we're going to throw them in. All right. This is for everybody in the world. This is Jason Busey. So you guys go ahead and tell me who wants to come to the bachelorette party with Jason Musi. So I just put in eight. Ow. I put in eight mint leaves and muddle them just a little bit because I don't like little pieces. Like I love mojitos, but I can't stand flecks of mint floating around in my mouth. The texture just makes me want to go Bleh, like gag. So I'm going to take Woodford Reserve next. Mm. And we're going to do three ounces. So it's going to get a drunk night tonight. You want to do less, do that. All I can tell you all is that I'm glad that I... Is this one ounce? Tried all of... That's two ounce. Oh. I'm one ounce is the other side. Has. Um, I'm glad that I tried all these before she just broke out fresh mint because there's no nose on anything else in this room tonight except for fresh mint. So that's it. I'm just saying, you told me to make my mixer. I'm doing what I was told. <laughs> yep. And then we're yep. gonna add some. What, how do you pronounce Angostura? it? Angostura. Angostura. How do? How would you have pronounced Angost, it? Ango. Angostura. Ango, oh, even though that you know how to pronounce it, you're still gonna pronounce it differently. It says Ango. Angostura. Okay. There we go. So I'm gonna add like four, five, six dashes. And then. Just make sure you write this down. Oh shit, that was from the last time we streamed. Oh boy. No, let's forget about it now. And then we're gonna add just a little bit of ice. So I'm not using uh um so I'm gonna let that oh shit. And now I'm going to just really, really quick, I'm going to fill this halfway up with my crushed ice. You want crushed ice? Okay. And we're going to shake it a little. I'm going to do it until I it is like almost unbearable to hold it. So maybe 20. <laughs> it's like ice. Ice baby. Okay, I can't get this. Pop it with your hand. Pop it. Pop it like it's hot. Pop, Pop it. it like it's hot. Pop it like it's hot. Ooh, ooh. So again, I don't want any of that mint stuff because I don't like it. Uh, Unif, Unif Poke, I do not know what's in my glasses. So I started out tonight drinking a Henry McKenna bottled in Bond, but I have a blind flight uh, of four whiskeys from the likes that I am trying to guess what is in a name. So... Uh, what uh, what I like the best, and then what proof they are. I'm kind of practicing for my uh, go around on ADHD whiskeys. Um, what's wrong with you? Um, Matt Matt Madness tournament. Um, but I don't know yet what's in my glass. 
So, and then what's right, left in here, I'm going to top it with some more all the way up to the very top. Ooh. Kind of just gently toss it. Just toss it gently. And then I'm going to take a sprig, pop it in, <clears throat> and look at a mint julep. Mint julep. How's your mint julep, julep? That actually sounds pretty amazing. So, to the Kentucky Derby. Mm. Oh, maybe I like this. Let's see where we're at with this one. That's good. That's really good. Well done, Care. Nice. You just made it. You just made a cocktail that I can get down with. Getting down, getting down. I mean, check that out. Isn't that pretty? I mean, that is. This is fantastic. Hmm. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm mm That is good. She made a cocktail lover out of this old guy. I love it. So again, this is Dance is rather not that tastes good. It looks fantastic. Well, thank you, Dan. And just so you know, yes. this is my recipe that I found on the internet and it Interwebs. Had, had over three thousand likes. So I think that they know what they're doing. Alex is no syrup. Actually, I skipped the simple syrup, and that's why I crushed the cube, and it called for one teaspoon water. So I let it sit to kind of um, break down the sugars a little, and then I muddled the, the stuff in just a little bit, and then I poured in the the bourbon. Yeah. Let it soak for a few minutes and in the ice while I filled up the other glass, shook it up to my hands froze. Yeah. And then poured it. She shook it up till her but hands froze. I, I also used my little strainer. And look at that. Look how pretty it is. It's just so pretty. Yeah, it's very and nice. These are That's my an cocktails. Instagram worthy cocktail right it there. It is. Yeah, you should take so, a picture of that. The julep. Yes, you have been watching, Alec, of course. That's so bourbon y, but it actually tastes good. It's just. She's like, it's so good. <laughs> But it does. It tastes really, really good. I'm again. Um, the back of my throat is actually starting to like bourbon, so it's that initial bite in the or burn in the back that gets me still. Aiden Craig, which careless whisper, Wham's version or Seether's version? That's um, what I'd wham. like to know. I like I'm Wham. Definitely down with the Seether version of Careless Whisper. Wait, was that Wham or was that Boy George? I think it was Wham. I think Wham did Careless Whisper. I, I could be wrong. I, I, don't I think know. I always get, you know, because Boy George. Jerry Bear says Wham. Wham? Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was Wham. You know, I miss George Michael. You, you guys used to hang out <laughs> back in the day? <laughs> no, he was just such a handsome man. You know, so sad. Uh, Stanley, the same rules absolutely apply for uh, San Antonio as they do for Las Vegas. Patrick, it wasn't a 30-minute cocktail. Seriously, I if I wouldn't have talked and been distracted so much, like this was made like in three minutes or less, you can make this cocktail. There's only one to me, and it's wham, because I can't stand Seether. Oh, there we go. All they right. call me Seether. No, no, that's Ver that's Veruca Salt. I know, but that that's what she says. They call me Seether. I don't think she says Seether. Yeah. No. I don't think so. What what does Veruca Salt say? I think it's the name of the song, but now that you've said they call me Seether, it's like in my head, but I know <laughs> it's not what it is. Uh, damn it, Carrie! <laughs> now it's like stuck in my head because I just. Uh. Hmm. Yes, you do. Go mm. get some mint. Um, Boy George was Culture Club with George Michael was Wham. Yeah, George Michael yeah. was with Wham. Says the white. No, I know that George Michael was wham. That's why I'm like, I miss George Michael. And I know Boy George's Culture Club, but I thought it was a Culture Club song. Oh, uh, the Jamie, fact that Carrie Jamie, knows Veruca Salt Jamie, is all that matters. You are so my girl. I'm going to make a Veruca Salt shirt that just says Veruca Salt. I don't know. How's she getting credit for? I'm the one that said it. They call me Seether. Oh, is that what she says? No, that is definitely not I, what she I says. I swear, I've been singing it ever since I heard that song, Seether. Does anybody know? Oh, you're killing me. 
Does anybody know what she says? All right. Right now I'm listening to Into Dust by Maisie Starr. Oh, good. Good call. Yeah, that's a great song. Or Dan L. If you actually muddle it, it, it also brings out the flavor. See, there is the song, Mark McKenzie says. So I don't they think, call me Seether. I just don't think she says they call me Seether. I think that there's something in it. It's it's something about Seether, but I don't know that they say she they call me Seether. I don't know. I, I, you that's know what? what that's what's throwing me off. So 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 since the nineties care, I know, I know. But can't, can't fight the seether. That's what it is. Yes. <laughs> See, I didn't think it was they call me seether. You can't fight the seether. But you know what, Roger D, every time or Ben, or both of you, I I will still sing when it comes on. They call me seether because that's just what I put in my that head. That is one hundred percent right. That can't is, fight the seether. I love it. I can't see her till I'm foaming at the mouth. <laughs> <laughs> see, that's the seether is neither big nor small. Are you guys just like you guys are just like giving me all the lyrics, aren't you? Yeah, I, I love cram it. her to the back. I cram her back in my mouth. Can't fight the seether. Seether. Can't fight the seether. Yep. Till I'm foaming at the mouth. See? Hashtag misheard lyrics. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? I where were you people and every other song? Seriously, I make I have the words. You know, the, I make up the, my own the funny tune. thing is, if there was only like technology, some form of technology that you could type in and say, "What are the words to this song?" I mean, that would be so great for you if there was just something out there that you could basically have at your fingertips. Maybe something that you are on like twenty three hours a day. That you might be able to just type that in and say, what are the words? That'd be pretty Amy, cool. Amy, you are so right. So who does this? That's the uh, theme song for Spy Hunter on the video game. No, yep. no. I was like, singing not, Spy Weezer. Hunter. Which Weezer? <laughs> what did you expect me to get that from? <laughs> who does? <laughs> Oh my gosh, seriously. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but Jamie, seriously, I can't the take 90s you. alternative, like that that's my jam. So like I want Marcy's Playground to come play at our wedding. They're only oh. like 7,000 to hire. Dan likes says yes for the drink exactly like you made it perfect. I'm just giving matter of fact info on mint for garnish. Slapping them in is just a technique. Yeah. Nothing to do with your masterpiece. Except I don't like let's, over... Let's nickname I Carrie the mint. I don't like a lot of mint. So I like just a titch. So I don't want to spank it, slap it, rub it down. I don't want to... You want to grab it. your hash pipe? I... <laughs> Stop it. Um, I just like it for garnishment. And that's all the purpose is for. Not to be too minty. All right, Mr. Like. Sir, good sir, since I just saw you chatting in chat, I believe that I have an order and I wrote down some proofs. The only one I'm a little bit concerned with the proof on is C. Yeah. So is a shooter... Is that um fifth or twenty nineteen? What is that? Shooter. So Shooter McGavin. So Shooter X I X. Isn't that 120 views and only 50 likes? Let's go. Smash, yeah. What is going on? Smash what is going on? The like button. You gotta smash the like. That, smash it. That triggers the the algorithm for uh, YouTube, and then we get a bunch of randoms in here, which is totally what we want. Uh, Klein and I were. A, very, we're whiskey hunting close to Marcy's Playground last month. So Marcy's Playground, I went and seen them live. Like I was like right up on their speaker, sitting right next to them. I mean, I don't think any of them are hot, but I just love Marcy's Playground's music. I, my one of my favorite song is Squirrel. Uh, no, it's it's not Squirrel. It's uh. No, I like a lot of their songs. But what is it? Isn't it like Robot Squirrel or no? Uh, uh, Sergeant Squirrel no, or no, Undercover Squirrel? No, you're thinking of Sergeant Pepper. No, I'm uh, not. Yes, you are. Sergeant Pepper? Yeah, that's yeah. that's the Beatles. Yeah, I know that's the Beatles. That's the scary. Beatles. <laughs> I thought that the Marcy Playground song was like Undercover Squirrel or Secret Agent Squirrel. Oh, or... Secret. Yeah, it's something Secret Squirrel. Yeah, there we go. See, I... maybe I was thinking of 
But the Toadies, can, Possum Kingdom. I like the Great Toadies song. too. I love Possum Kingdom. Great. So song. W- wouldn't it be epic? So like we could afford one band, like Marcy's Playground, but I'd like to have a collection of them all. Okay. So Dan, like you're listening now. I said I think I've got an order that I like, and I think I've got some proofs down. So my favorite one is B, and I wrote that in at 115 proof. Um, my second favorite is a, because of the sweetness of it, even though it's really low proof, I wrote 94 proof on a, uh, C I wrote for my third favorite. It's a, it's a rye, uh, for 110 proof. And then the fourth one is a little bit nutty. I think the proof might be higher than I wrote down, but I wrote down 105 proof. It doesn't, doesn't drink hot, but I don't know. The proof on on D is kind of throwing me off a little bit. But those are what I wrote down. And I wrote them down quick and I stuck with them because I'm trying to like get this 30 second thing like under control before I go with Matt. So I could be completely way off, but that's what I went with. So first place is B, 115 proof. Second place is A, 94 proof. Third place is C, 110 proof. And fourth place is D, 105 proof. So hit me with it, brother. Tell me how bad I did. D is Joseph Magnus, 110. I said 105, so I was five off. Okay. I put Joseph Magnus Special Reserve last. All right. It has a little funk to it. It's a little weird nuttiness to it so barn door yeah i was sitting on their speaker i was i was right up front it was the bus it's like they were just it was like my own private little concert. first order is fine yep so c the so the next reverse order would be c i said 110 <coughs> which i again i'm guessing is going to be higher since joseph magnus was higher yeah 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 so it's definitely high rye okay so I was 15 off on that one. And it is a rye, which I knew. Thomas H. Handy. Nice. That that definitely had that um that minty um willet type of, of rye spice to it that I get that almost like a, a pickly type. So I damn it. I wrote down 125 and I changed it to 110. Why did you know, I do that? It's just like a test. You never change your answers. Ah, I wrote you down 125 that. and changed it. That's okay. You know that though. And see, this is what I this is what I gotta get through my head. I gotta get it right. I gotta be on point to make sure that I'm doing this right for for the for the blind against Sam and Bobby. All right, so A, I said was 94 proof. Elmer T. Lee, 90 proof. I actually wrote ETL next to that. With the question mark. So that was four off. So then B, I said, was 115 proof. I know. Trust your gut always. <sighs> Damn it. A is, A is so good. A is so good. It's just, there's nothing to it, but it's got that that sweet strawberry um, starburst note to it. I just love Elmer Teeley. Jamie, that is awesome. I love the Smashing Pumpkins. It's good stuff. That's good stuff. The one thing we saw from everyone so far is don't second guess yourself. I know, I know. And that's the thing. I mean, well, when it, the problem is I went back to it. When I first went through, I wrote 125. And then I then I, I was thinking something along the lines of, of a will it rye. I'm like, I don't, I haven't had a will it rye that's been that high of proof. So that's when I second guessed myself and went back to a 110 thing. It, it might be Will It Rye, but it wasn't. So, bleh. so B, B I said was my favorite, and it was 115 proof. I just got, I got to party with the Pumpkins at their last arena show in Chicago and hung out with James and Jimmy all night. It was amazing. You Jeez, son of ben. a bitch, really? That's pretty sweet. That's awesome. B is J. Mattingly Pandemic Special 114 proof. What? That's my blend. 
That's the Destination Bourbon Pandemic Special. Nice. So my favorite is my own blend. <laughs> well done, Mike. And uh, I said it was 115 proof and it was 114 proof. Well done. The time limit may benefit me. It might. You know what it, it might. was? It was all the excitement. It got you off track of posting to everybody about no, our good news. No, it wasn't. I mean, I just second guessed myself because I thought I knew what C was. I thought it was Willett. And it wasn't. It was Thomas H. Handy. Um, wow. Nice nice flight, Dan. Like, that was awesome. Oh, man. I got to tell you, this B is pretty damn good. Any of you guys that didn't get in on that Destination Bourbon Pandemic special. Don't worry. We'll have another one coming up. Mike knows what Mike's like. <laughs> yeah, he got that right. Just think about it. Put that last, DC. Where would I have been then? You know what? This B sucks. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Cheech says time limit should even the playing field a bit. The time limit thing is going to be difficult, I think, because, I mean, having 30 seconds not only to get your – man, that's good. Well done overall, sir, on sizable proof miss. One sizable proof miss. The rest were tight. Yeah, that I, – I, the C1 killed me, buddy. It really did because I got – once I get something in my brain, you, and you know how this is, you got I got it in my brain, I'm like – as soon as I drank it, I think I said out loud, ooh, that tastes like Willet. And so once I put that in my brain, I couldn't push it out. I'm like, oh, it's got to be around that. Even though it tastes higher, and I originally wrote 115 but or 125, it doesn't matter. Still fun. The time limit is is going to be murder, Dan. I think that's, that's going to be the part that's going to kill me, is like getting it in. And then texting it to Matt in the in the proper amount of time. I'm not going to be able to back to overthink it. But that might kill me. Getting it in. <laughs> Getting it in is going to be the problem. It's going to be a time crunch. <laughs> 30 seconds to taste is extremely difficult, honestly. But it makes it easier to watch slash get shit done. Well, especially if you're involved. Good God, man. Good Lord, man. We need to put a time limit on you tasting things. Teach says, practice all week. It should feel natural. I did not even send the key to Destination Bourbon before the flight, which is why I had to type the answer. So really great work. Yes, thank you, Dan. I you appreciate that. You know what? That. More people need to do that so that no one can look at the keys in privacy and then go do a challenge and win I, it. I like to think that most people would not do that anyway. So, you know, we've got a good community, great people. You know, send you send the keys. I think 99% of the people can be trusted to, to do that. So. <laughs> I don't even know what percentage that is, but yes, sir. I'm glad you agree because you know you. Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I'm telling you. Those are some good bottles, man. Thank you, Dan. Like, what uh, what else you got over there? You got something else that you were going to talk about tonight. Well, no, I'll crack that one because if I drink this all gone. Here, you want to finish that? Because that's so strong. Sure. But um, so Sean Opperman, he knows me too well. So he, so Smooge, he introduced me to. He came over here like a month ago and brought me a four pack of Smooge, which was delicious. It's like crushed pineapple. It's a pina colada in a can, and it's amazing. And then he sent Kleiner home with pina colada. Um, it's a pineapple coconut hard seltzer. So I haven't tried it before. It's 110 calories, and I've become quite a fan of some of these. It's from Oddsides Ale. Yep. So Oddsides Ale, um, Oddside. Oddside Ale, yep. And then this came from Sean Opperman, so thank you, Sean. It's not – wait. No. Take out that C. Where? What? what are you no, talking? it's it's – I, I don't know. I have a can of it upstairs. I'll have to look. Smooge. It's smooge. S with a J. S M O O J. Smooge. Yeah, smooge. Do you like, see the like Bobby from My Whiskey C She Wine just celebrates 54th birthday? Actually, Jason, yes. Uh, Carrie and oh I gosh. have been invited to be on their stream uh, tomorrow to celebrate Bobby's birthday. So we're super excited to be hanging out with Sam and Bobby. We absolutely adore them. And I and I know that you guys know that we absolutely adore them. So we'll be on their stream tomorrow. You guys can all come and uh, wish Bobby a, a happy birthday. It'll be a lot of fun hanging out with them. And then it'll be even more fun kicking their ass on the, you, 
on Matt's stream. So Jamie just said, I haven't seen Opperman in so long with a sad face. So Jamie, I think we should invite Opperman on. You like that? I do. I, I need that is to add, not sweet. But I need to add a packet or two of equal. Okay. I was going to say, because... I actually think that's pretty good. So that seltzer is... But it uh, tastes just like a pina colada. It tastes like a very muted pina colada. It is very not sweet. It gives you the the presence of pina colada and then not sweet at all. So that's... So if you wanted to add like fresh pineapple juice to it or something, I'm just going to add some equal. Uh, Eric, she, she <laughs> might said, have been saying spooge. I said I mean. splooge. Is oh. it spooge or splooge? What are, you, what are we talking about? We're not talking about the, the drink anymore, well, because right? Because every time I'm not really I sure. think of smooge, I think of splooge. So is it splooge or spooge? I'm not sure what you're trying to say. What is splooge? It's, Sp it's what people call stuff. What stuff? White stuff. I'm not sure. Not really sure. I love Sean Opperman, too. Who doesn't love Sean Opperman? And Bobby does not look 54. No. He looks like he's 24. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Bobby's Bobby's a sexy, sexy man. He and he's bald. Well, of course. I mean that that adds to his sexiness, right? There's no doubt about it. Everman, he he, you know what? So he's just a kid. By the way, Bobby's not 54. Yeah, don't say that. Oh, uh, Mike, Look. I'm sad you're going against Bobby in the first round, but you're gonna beat him because you're gonna win the whole Matt Madness. Dave Markowski, I love you. You're the greatest. I'm not gonna win the whole thing, but I would. It'd be fun if I did. And I'm actually sad I'm going against Bobby in the first round, too. I'm going against Bobby and Sam. So Matt's kind of handicapping me. He's putting me against two people. He's putting me against I Whiskey and She Wines. See what we can do. See what we can do. I just can't wait to hang with, with Sammy. Sammy, Sammy. Which she hasn't made a present yet. Maybe she's giving Bobby an early birthday gift. Yeah, she <laughs> Wow, Carrie. Wow, wow. Maybe, mm. you know, she was saying on her stream last week, I don't do it in the butt. Maybe she's finally for his birthday. <laughs> it's her early birthday present. <laughs> Sammy, I apologize. That was so inappropriate and not polite. But you said it on your stream. <laughs> Love you, girl. <laughs> I, I have nothing. <laughs> I have nothing. Okay. That's what you get, Sammy, for not coming in. Because it's Matt. <laughs> Matt Madness. Coming Matt Madness. <coughs> Telling you what, man. The, the turds can make up some crazy songs. I love their Matt Madness song. Oh, Jerry Bear. A queen talks much worse than that. You don't read the same books I do. They're filthy. What, you read? <laughs> we just went there, Jamie. <laughs> no place to go from here but up. <laughs> I mean, you know, it's bottoms up, bottom up. Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, All that just happened. World in a minute. I'm telling you, just when you think you can't do any more, then something like that happens. <laughs> oh, <it's> just... <laughs> Even my dog looked at the TV. Oh my god, DC. <laughs> yeah, it's like the needle scratching. <laughs> yeah. Well. I, I, I couldn't do anything but look down. I was like, what? Did you do what? Really? So if you want a good romance novel, look up. It's by um, Anne Reliquine, which is Anne Rice's first writer's name before she got married to Stan Rice. Clearly. And it's the true story of Sleeping Beauty. And let me tell you, it will rock your world. I had to look shit up. It's a, it's a trilogy. It's awesome. What do you mean you had to look things up? Um, I had to look some of the stuff up. I didn't know what some of the stuff was. Like what stuff? I'm not even gonna go there. But you just were talking about Sam and Bobby and and I know because you know. um yeah, you know what? Some of my friends sugar read the Harlequin series. Destination stuff. Harlequin. No, Anne Rice takes it up like you know where I would shades go. Shades of gray. I would go like, Destination Harley Quinn in a second. Right, you do like your Harley Quinn. Um, just so you know, like Fifty Shades of Grey is lame compared to Anne Rice's Sleeping Beauty. Like, I, Fifty Shades of Grey is like the shittiest. Ugh, I hate that movie. I hated the book. I couldn't even read the whole book. <laughs> she so meant bad. what she said. She said what she meant. Yep. Oh. End of story. Uh, Mojo. No. No, hey. Mojo. 
no. What is that? Bumpkins. Not, nope. 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 We're not talking is about. Is that like NWA or nope, something? Nope. We're not going there. Nope. Okay. Nope. Ah, uh, yes. After after we're done tonight, make sure you guys check out Live Wire on uh, uh, Live Wire Whiskey. Thank you, Cheech. It's fantastic. <laughs> Just go Whiskey Channel or book reviews. It's yeah. uh, apparently a little bit of column A, a little bit of column B, my friend. Stop busting my chops, Jer Bear. Or I'll kick your ass the next time you deliver your meat. I'm gonna... <laughs> <laughs> he did. He came to my oh, house. Oh, did he deliver the? He left me two boxes of meat. I miss Jer Bear this week. I'm telling you what, man. No, the, the nose they on made this the Elmer movie about the book, and the book sucked. Mm. And I couldn't even watch the movie because the book sucked that bad. Mm -hmm. Seriously, read Sleeping Beauty, and um, you'll never look at that stuff. <laughs> You're an ass, Jer Bear. No. <laughs> He is not. Jer Bear is a great guy. Fantastic he is a great guy. guy, but right now he is like... Live whiskey. He's being a state Live wire whiskey. So, yeah, I'm going to be on... Um, or we're going to be on I Whiskey She Wines tomorrow. And then... Uh, I got to look it up. I'm going to be on Shayla's channel with uh, Trev and HBR doing a scotch thing. On, I believe, May 1st. Don't quote me with that, but I believe it's May 1st. So Saturday, May 1st on uh, Whiskey Central. We're going to be there doing some doing some sketch, some sketch with uh, Trev Wilson. The beautiful Trev Wilson, the even more sexy mullet-like HBR. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be amazing hanging out with, with those two. Got to hang out with HBR in person. He's even better in person. This guy's just if you're not if you're not subscribed to Hot Buttery Rolls, make sure you get over there and check out Hot Buttery Rolls, as well as Trev, the Bourbon Wrench, as well as Shayla, Whiskey Central, as well as Cheech Artolino, and as well as Live Wire Whiskey. You guys gotta do it all. Yeah, I'm doing scotch, Jamie. I I'm getting into some stuff. So Oh, and good luck tomorrow on your exam. My exam. Jamie's. She says she oh, Jamie has an exam tomorrow. Yeah. Condolences and having to do a scotch flight. Well, Gary, we'll see what she what she got me into. But um, I've actually found a few recently that I I really kind of like. So I'm I'm I don't know if I'm happy about that or not because of the cost of scotch and getting involved in another vice uh, more than the one that is behind me. The responsible part of me has to go to bed. <laughs> I understand, Maureen. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. We love you so much. We're glad you were here. I know you started this, Alec. You totally started this. There's no doubt about it. No doubt about it. Jamie says thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Seriously, I mean, good luck. So yep. what's your exam in? DC's out, too? Oh, no. Wheels no. is saying hi. He's saying hi. What's up, Wheels? Uh, hope, hope your stream went well the other night with the mash bill. Hope you raise a lot of money. Appreciate uh, appreciate you. Hope you're doing okay. Oh, man. I'm telling you what. Elmer T. Lee's legit. I don't care what you say. I wish you could still get it for, for what it is. You can still get that for 35 bucks. This is just... This was one of my favorites for so long. Yes, Matt, that is exactly what I mean. I mean, I like scotch. It doesn't taste like scotch. Yep, completely. If you can give me fat guy bourbon scotch... I like scotch. Scotch, scotch, scotch. So that's awesome, Jamie. My mom was an RN. She was working on her nurse practitioner. Um, and I have uh, I have a huge family full of nurses and nurse practitioners. So good luck to you. Yes. Also subscribe to Whiskey Mountains. She's awesome, too. Uh, Elmer is good. It's better for smashing things. It works so well to smash Golden Glens. I don't know if you guys have ever smashed a Golden Glen with a bottle of Elmer uh, 100. That may be the greatest feeling in the world, especially if the Golden Glen belonged to a certain self-proclaimed savant. Sav not. I don't know how you, how you actually spell that. But, and especially if you smashed it with uh, Elmer... 100 that also belong to that self-proclaimed savant. 
fantastic. Fantastic. So did you see what Maureen put? Yours should be getting the package, which I did see in Ooh. our mail memo. It says that we will be receiving a package on Monday. Am I receiving a package, Miss Beautiful Franchi, or is uh, Carrie Lynn receiving so, a package? So let's just put it this way. Maureen, the fran the Franchies send the best gifts. They always Franchies, are. Franchies are great. You guys people. are so generous. We love you guys so much. And not only that. But we love spending time with you, and Gary is always so sweet when he comes to visit, and he stays the night, and he cleans up after himself. He makes the bed. He puts the toilet seat down. He trained him so well. Libation exploration. I'm sorry you're late, too, but we still love you, and we're glad you're here. You know, you can you can catch the replay. It's all good. It's all good. Um, I've been finding I'm liking ryes more than I used to these days. So Aiden, I kind of vacillate between bourbons and ryes based off of the seasons. And now that I'm getting out of the cold season, I'm getting more back into my fat guy bourbons and they're making me happy. Oh, Mike and Carrie will be receiving a package. <laughs> Gary's blushing. Gary or so, Carrie? Oh, he's blushing. Gary is. You really are. Gary, you're such a sweet guy. And you help me with my math skills. Whoever would have thought anyone could help me with that. Yeah. The replay is what I usually do. Yeah, I get that. When I stay there, I will not do any of those things, and you will never invite me back. <laughs> oh, I will, Alec, you are so full of it. I will still invite you back. How can I not invite you back? I highly doubt that you have an ill-mannered bone in your body. He doesn't. He just likes to talk shit. Yeah, he's a uh, shit talker. Aiden, I do like Pikesville for the money. Um, it's not one of my go-tos, but for the money, it's, it's a great ride. Fantastic, right? Yep. So anyway, we're probably going to wrap it up so that uh, you guys can get on over to um, Live Wire Whiskey and check out check out what they're doing. So um, we love you guys all so much. Thanks for hanging out with us. I think I'm going to do okay. I'm going to keep practicing my proofs. I'm going to keep practicing a game that I don't even know what the game's going to be. That's the cool thing about what Matt's doing with Matt Madness is that Every game's going to be different, and they're all all the flights are different. We're not going to know what the heck we're up against until we actually start doing it. So I'm super excited for all of that. But we love you guys all. We love you so much. Thanks for hanging out with us tonight. Um, you guys are the best part of what we do, and you make us so happy. You make us really enjoy um, drinking bourbon and hanging out. So thank you. Love Cheers, you. Cheers. Good night. Peace. We love you guys.